What on earth am I gonna do with this? You know, usually I unbox slings that are like, I don't know, I'll, I'll usually buy like maybe 10 at most 15. Yeah, the OBT slings, remember that? We have 80 slings, that's right, 80 baby tarantulas, 8-0, not 1-8. 8-0, yeah, that is insane just thinking about that. Let me get this top part open. I see the container and uh, all 80 are in this small container? What? Okay, any more in here? I like how he padded everything at the side to makes it look like a little Great Wall of China. I mean, a foreign, I, I don't know what I'm talking about, but yeah, I guess there's nothing else in there. Let's see. Now, before I show you the slings, these a Ceratogyrus sandery, the Namibia horned baboon. I had two, now I have one, which is hopefully a female. I bought two as slings. One unfortunately became a matured male, so I sent him off for a breeding loan. And well, the female, my friend's female, unfortunate. Oh, guys, look, my turtle is out in the garden. <laughs> this is so not common. This red-eared slider is usually in the pond, and today, He's just out sun tanning. Well, I mean, there's no sun, but he's out chilling in the garden. Anyways, back to this. So where was I? Yeah, my male Sandery got eaten by the female, unfortunately, but he was a productive male. Before he was eaten, he went to get us some good babies. Ooh, it's really damp. Oh, soggy egg crates, gross. But yeah, I still have another one in the animal room and hopefully that one's a female because they're both from the same egg sac, right? Brothers and sisters. But that one matured out quicker. I feed them both the same. So this one is a bit plump and hasn't matured out into a mature male. So I guess, hopefully, high hopes that it's a female. Oh my goodness, look at this, you guys. <gasps> This is literally, I've never opened more than 20 slings before. What the? What on earth am I gonna do with this? <laughs> so if there are 80 slings in here, I'm assuming that there were 160 slings in total in the egg sac because usually for breeding loans, the male owner gets 50% and the female owner gets 50%. I don't know for other animals, but that's how tarantula breeding works, I guess. I guess it also can depend on your negotiation between the your, your, your friend. I really hope all 80, every single one is alive. Man, the top layer is like full, and then when you move it, there's the second layer, and then you move that one, there's a third layer, and you move that one, there's a fourth layer. Oh my goodness, you guys. This is like the best Christmas present ever, although it's not technically a present because it was my meal, and yeah, whatever. It still feels like Christmas. I'm gonna have to go out, get the deli cups, poke the holes, air holes, ventilation holes, whatever you wanna call them, and then substrate in, and finally rehouse these guys. So for now, we're gonna let them go back to sleep till I come back home and mess with them for the rehousing. So yeah. Good night, little dudes, and I will see you in a bit. So this, my friends, is what 80 slings look like. Well, there are 77 over here because I gave two to my friend the other day when I visited him, and unfortunately, we had one that didn't make it. Yeah, as sad as it sounds, when you ship a lot of tarantula slings, you may have one or two deaths along the way, it's just the way it is. Sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't, but yeah. So I actually did want to film all the rehousings on camera, but I was like, yeah, I, there's 80 slings. I, it's not gonna take a very short while, it could take even an hour. Yeah, it actually took me about an hour, because I had to cut the straw, put the tarantula in, but I mean, I didn't move the tarantula out of the straw. I just put the straw in after cutting it because you know, I, I, I can't deal with 80 tarantulas bolting on me because these Ceratogyra sanderies are old worlds. And can you imagine if I were to do them individually from the straw and poke them out? Yeah, that, that's just not gonna be fun. All right, let me open this and I'll show you the sling up close. There is the sling. So cute. There is the size of it compared to my hand. Super tiny, super cute but super bolty, my gosh, look at it. It's just waiting for the time to bolt on me. Like, if I were to just turn over here and then I look back, 
it's probably gonna be gone so gotta pay attention to these old walls you know there's a clear shot of the underneath of one of the slings beautiful they may look cute now but once they reach adulthood man you better not mess with these guys so I guess that'll be it for this video. I just wanted to show you guys all the slings that my male Sandery has given us. Woohoo! So, bam! Just like that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to thumbs it up. If you didn't, feel free to thumbs it down. If you're new to this channel, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll know when I upload next. I'll see you guys in the next video and you guys take care. Peace.